Hello, Scott Hayes from the Kendall Academy talking about some chipping today. I know it seems like a recurring theme, but the flat left wrist, very important. Do not want this left wrist to bend. Creates a premature low point. You could chunk it, you could blade it. So we want the left wrist to stay flat. I'm sure you guys have seen a device like this before. Many other guys, uh, golfing machine guys using this. It's a device to show that if the flat left wrist stays flat, the club will remain behind it. But what's important for these chip shots, at least if you don't need a lot of power, you do not need to turn and cock your flat left wrist. Now you will need to turn and cock it for bunker shots, deep rough, lob shots, anything where you need speed. But on a basic little chip, I'd like to see the left wrist stay flat and also inactive. So what you're left with then is you're left with a little turn so your left shoulder can keep turning and as your left arm swings your left hand gets closer to your right shoulder so your right elbow is going to bend and your right elbow is going to straighten out. All the while the flat left wrist remains flat as you take it back no turning or cocking right elbow will bend as you take it down and through, left wrist stays flat, right arm straightens out to both arms straight, flat left wrist means the club head does not pass the training aid right there. 